what's up everyone? It's Mandy Wheeler with UNR Real Estate. Today I'm bringing you to Woolwich, Maine, where to set the scene for you, we are on a very quiet dirt road. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but all you can hear is like a couple of crows and then like a neighbor's dog that we startled by driving by. But this is a dead end road. It's so quiet. It's so peaceful out here. This is such an exciting listing. I'm so excited to show this to you. This is, was built in 2018. It's three bedrooms plus a bonus room, three full baths, and it's on over just over two acres of land. So to come in to get here, you have to pass through this like horse farm and it's so beautiful. We'll, sh we'll show you some pictures of it. There's like, you know, these like white picket fences and then you just drive through and there's like horses and you're like coming through and then there's meadows and woods and it's so quiet. It's so peaceful. It's like beautiful rural Maine. And then out here in this little community on this dirt road is this house that is newer. So if you're looking for something that doesn't need a lot of maintenance, you got this newer home that's moving ready. So we're going to do a full video walkthrough tour. Let's start upstairs. Come on. When you walk up the stairs, you're greeted with this open concept living room, dining room, kitchen. One of my favorite things. You've got vaulted ceilings here. Um, it's just a really lovely, big, open, bright space. You've got this slider that goes out into the deck. We'll go out in the backyard at the end and check that out. And it's just a really nice, bright kitchen. So you've got um, forced hot water baseboard heat, but then there's also a heat pump in here as well that acts as heat in the winter and AC in the summer. Um, this is a brand new countertop, which I'm really excited about. This is a quartz countertop that they put on and it just looks so lovely with the backsplash and the cabinets. Um, this is all real tile, real hardwood floors. Um, you can tell that this builder in 2018 didn't cut any corners because everything is super well done. Um, the lighting is really neat. Everything is on a dimmer and you can hit things to turn on and off and dim. So just a nice, bright, big kitchen. You've got a propane gas cook stove, your dishwasher's over here, your sink with your window looking out to your backyard. You've got the island lights, and then open into here is your um, living room here. We There's a, actually a, um, I'll take this down to show you. I didn't mean for it to fall, but I wanted you to see that there's a, um, you know, mount for your TV here. So this stays with it. So it's a great spot to put your television. I'm just going to set this up here for now. Um, we staged this whole thing. So all of the staging is by myself and um, my agency. So all of this will obviously be gone at closing, but it gives you an idea of what the space looks like up here. So let's go to this side first and we'll come down the hallway. In here, you've got this nice big um, storage closet. I always want to show you the closets because I feel like sometimes those don't get photographed. So, and then you've got the hallway bathroom here and it's got your washer dryer in it. So you've got um, this granite top uh, vanity and then you have a full bathtub here, a really nice washer dryer, Samsung. And then you've also got a closet here that is also quite a bit of storage. So tons of storage in this space, all real, tile, real hardwood floors, really nice quality. Here's one bedroom out of the three plus the bonus room downstairs, which I'll show you. So this is a queen size bed. This is our staging that gives you an idea. Nice big space, plenty of room for a king if you want it. Four windows, so it's super bright. And this house, I don't know if you could tell from when we were outside, maybe not, but it's kind of set up on a hill. So it creates this feeling of like, I don't know, there's something lovely about like looking out and kind of like looking down, even though we're technically just like on the main level, it's just a really nice private feeling space. And I feel like I can really see everything well. So another nice big closet right here. I just love this house. If you're looking for like move-in ready, easy, like good quality, this is it. And then this is the, um, second bedroom. I'm showing you the smaller ones first and then we'll go to the big primary suite after. But this is also a queen size bed. It also has three windows in it so it's really bright. It's got a similar size closet to the other one I just showed you. Really lovely space. They all have fans in them too. 
and now we'll come down to the other side of the house. I also really love that. So like, I don't know if you have kids or you know, whatever your situation is, but I like that there's like two bedrooms and a bathroom on one side and then on the other side, you have like the primary suite with your own bathroom. I just love that feeling of space. If you do have like guests staying or children or whatever. So this is the biggest bedroom out of the three up here. Again, queen size bed. We use all queen size beds when we stage. This also has a TV mount in it that stays, so a great spot to put television. If you don't have a TV in your bedroom, it's easy to remove. You got a fan here too, and then you walk through, through your um, really big closet, which I'm pretty jealous of, to be honest. <laughs> it's like a really nice big space to store your clothes, if you have a lot of clothes. And then you walk through it, and then you've got a double vanity here, and you've got a full tub, window looking out, and even more storage over there. So just really, whoever designed this, this builder, it's just like really like conveniently built, and the layout is really easy to understand. It's just a really sweet spot. Yeah. Okay, let's go downstairs. So this is sort of like a little landing space that goes up to the garage. Let's come in here first. I didn't um, stage this room, I could have, but I was like, I'm gonna just leave it empty and let people envision what they want. It also has a TV mount in it, and it has its own full bathroom right here, which is super cool. It also has automatic lights in the bathroom, so they just turn on when you walk in, which Simple Me really loves that. Um, there's a stand-up shower here, toilet, single vanity, window, so we're technically underground just a little bit. Like the ground is right like here probably, I'm like trying to figure out roughly here, but it still feels really bright and really clean. It's got a little echoey because there's nothing in it, but it's a really nice big spot. So if you wanted like a guest suite where they have their own bathroom, maybe it's your art space and office, whatever you want. And here is the little utility room. So you've got your circuit breaker panel and your boiler your pressure tank, all the mechanicals of the space. <laughs> and then there's even more storage. Let me show you, come on. Oh, this is also a, a sliding barn door, which I'm a sucker for. And then you come out here. I just put tape over this so no one would lock it. There's nothing wrong with it, but that goes into the garage. I wanna show you this really quickly because this is a ton of space. Um, these are our storage bins for our staging, but this is a nice big space of storage as well as in here. And it even kind of goes down and around the side over here, which is pretty neat. So if you got a lot of stuff, you got places to store it here. <laughs> this is your two car garage, obviously attached to the house. So how rad to be able to pull your car in in rainy, snowy Maine and be able to walk right into your house. There's a little workshop space there. These are electric garage door openers. They open for you with a little clicker. So now we come out here. We just exited through, you know, the main entrance that you're probably gonna come in. This is the driveway and you can drive right into your parking spaces there and go right up into the house. And then we'll come out here. This is a lovely mixture of landscaping. You've got some nice just lawn. It's really sunny. It's overcast this morning, but I've been here when I was staging and it's actually a really sunny space. So if you wanna have gardens, you have opportunity for that here. And then you also have this huge shed. So this was built by a local reputable company, New England Rent to Own LLC. And this is a very large oversized shed for you. So if you've got some tools or some tractors or whatever, you got a spot for it all right there. Um, I love the mixture of landscaping here with the rocks and ledge and then the grass here. And then it kind of dips down over, it's not super steep, but there's just like a little bit of a hill right here and then it goes into the woods. Uh, your private well is right there. You've got your propane tanks that heat your um, boiler and also your cook stove. And then you've actually got a generator there for you as well. So thank you so much for touring this listing with me. As a little recap, this was built in 2018 as three bedrooms plus a bonus room, three full baths, just over two acres of land. We're at 121 Norway Drive in Woolwich. If you're interested in this listing and you don't already have an agent, you can reach out to me. My number is 
333-1050. Thank you so much for watching.